Hi, welcome back to Sotoku Tech. Yeah, I've been working with Meshtastic for some time now. I started back in March of 2024, and so it's been over a year. I've got almost 60 videos on the topic. You might find that pretty interesting. But I just saw this post on X. It's from The Meshtastic, and they're talking about how you may have outgrown the long, fast modem preset. So, yeah, by default, when you flash Meshtastic, it lands on the long, fast uh, modem preset. And let's look at the difference between long fast and some of the other presets. So long fast has a data rate of 1.07 kilobytes per second, and it's got a link budget of 153 decibels. Okay, so let's see how that stacks up against the recommended medium fast. Medium fast is three times the data rate, 3.52 kilobytes per second, and almost the same link budget at 148 decibels. So medium fast looks like a pretty good option, and that's what they're recommending, at least in our region. The Arizona mesh is recommending we go to medium fast. They have other specific settings. And yeah, so I went to our Discord here for the Tucson mesh, and it's saying it's been kind of quiet here. Uh, everybody's using the new settings by recommended by the larger azmesh.net community. Yeah, they're saying it's most of the default long fast uh, modem presets aren't monitored well. Oh, and all of our mountaintop rout routers are using the new medium fast settings recommended by the Arizona mesh.net. Let's take a look here. So this is long fast in Tucson. There's quite a few nodes still with long fast, but we're not seeing anything in Phoenix because all of our mountaintop routers have switched over to medium fast. So if you go to the Arizona Discord, so this is the Arizona Mesh Discord. They're talking about don't make a repeater or router until you talk to us. And yeah, any request for router, repeater, or router late needs to go through the approval process. So it sounds kind of formal, kind of uh, takes away from that ad hoc, hey, I just put Meshtastic on my device and now I'm on the mesh. Yeah, there's an infrastructure leadership team. So, you know, on one hand, you can kind of be like, yeah, well, you know, that that's crimping my style. But then on the other hand, I think if you want to, the, the mesh is a community, whether you want to think you're part of it or not. Yeah, see here, here's Tucson. These are the medium fast and we're seeing all the way into Phoenix yeah yeah not a lot of nodes and these are only the nodes that are broadcasting their location so if a node isn't broadcasting its location it doesn't show up on the map necessarily so there may be a lot more nodes that we're not seeing but anyway yeah so that medium fast seems to be working out so this Rattler Goldmine Peak Okay, and it's configured as a router late, and we see it's uh, GPS coordinates 33 and minus 111, so I know that's not in Tucson. Well, yeah, wow, it's almost in, it's in Gilbert, Arizona, which is on the outskirts of Phoenix. Let's run a trace route, see if we get away with that. Oh yeah, there's my trace route from, that was actually from my kitchen table. I don't know what Mishtast FFF is. We hit Mount Lemon and then we made it all the way to that router in in Gilbert, Arizona. Yeah, so I really recommend you go to meshtastic.org, look for your local groups, check out this article, look for the link down below. Leave a comment. Is your mesh using long fast or medium fast or something else? Let us know. Check out my previous video. I put all of these antennas to a test in a head-to-head -head showdown. Also, give this video a like. Leave a comment down below, and before you go watch more of my Mesh-tastic videos, please click on subscribe. Thank you very much.